Hey everybody, here's here with some more Pokemon Shield. And on the last episode, we were doing some more uh, Star Championship, Star Tournament here. Um, Opal to the rescue, because everybody else was getting put in a body bag. Poor Alistair. Poor Beatty. Alright, I expected so much more from Mawile, but then Opal came in and she did a great job. So, today let's see if we can get Melanie and uh, Marnie, unless someone else pops up before uh, Marnie, but... Okay, I'm expecting great things from that Lapras. Let's see how uh, how we go with Melanie here. So we are up against Opal and Mustard right away out the door. Marnie and Hop versus Peony Kabu. I, I feel like Hop has to win that. How, I don't understand how people are beat. Oh my god, Milo and Alistair? There's no way Avery loses to Milo-Alistair combination. No way. Ever. No way. What, what do you have to say? Alright, someone needs to chill. Wait, who are we up against? Hold on, let me see. We're up against uh, Opal and Mustard. Okay, let's not... Opal and Mustard. Opal and Mustard. Okay, Opal's gonna have that wheezing. Mustard is gonna open up a fighting types. Um... I suppose we could get a little crazy here. Let's open up with Yomi. Let's do this. I hope my allies just keep getting better. <laughs> oh god. No more Alistair BD combinations, please. Where are all the Kabu and Opals at? Hop, Hop actually did really well. Once he got to Zacian after his sheep went down his Zacian was a monster let's win this nice and cool he says all these cold comments she needs to relax it looks warm out here I guess it's because of the grass <laughs> jurors and is it Melody Melody all right we're versus the geriatrics team team geriatrics Weezing and the young chap. Yeah, it's Melody. Oh my god, we got a dancer. We got a dancer. I haven't battled at your side for quite a long time, old man. Whoa, we're still too young to be reminiscing about the good old days. Alright, what do we do here? Who is the biggest threat? It's always, 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 always going to be you. You're always going to be the biggest. He's going to fake out me. That's the smartest thing to do. He did not fake out Yomi. That was not smart. And because of that, you shall suffer utter defeat from a shiny that I hatched from an egg. Mr. Ryan Flynn, Strange Steam. That's for Mr. Ryan. Dude, tell me how Mr. Ryan is surviving. Oh, Strange Steam can does that move have a hundred percent confusion rate? What do I do about this? This Como old. It's a monster match. Um, let's just do another Zen headbutt. Protect wheezing. A oh, good thing I didn't attack the wheezing. I actually thought about it. Opal knows things, man. Those things, Como. Oh, I'm level 100. It's not gonna go well for you. Okay. Go ahead and get Ken Terrell out here. What you gonna do, Mr. Ryan? Of course. The toughest opponents only make us stronger. All right, time to get bigger. Alright, what are we gonna do? Do I sacrifice my ally? Oh, he cannot Dynamax! He can't... He can't Gigantamax. Uh, what do we do here? Zen... Oh, no effect! Because he's part dark. That's right. We could do a hammer arm. That's what we do. That's right, it's a dark fighting type. That's right. Almost clicked uh, Zen Headbutt. Can you imagine how dumb that would have been? Okay, Yomi has just 
We haven't had any trouble. So far, Melanie's doing great only because Yomi is steamrolled, completely steamrolled uh, the old man here. Psychic attack. Dude, Melanie's good? Her Mr. Rhyme is tanking it up right now. And Mr. Rhyme is definitely dancing to the beat. Meteor Mesh. Goodbye, Togekiss. My level 100 Yomi is a bit too much for this turn. I kind of wish they did all level up as you went, as you kept going. That'd be cool. Freeze dry. Oh. Attacking through the confusion. Oh, good lord. That move certainly woke me up. I'm just impressed that the Mr. Rhyme has survived this long. Because uh, Opal hadn't killed Mr. Rhyme yet. So that's pretty interesting. Oh, she's gonna Dynamax. We're gonna Dynamax together. We're gonna Dynamax together. Yeah, here she comes. Here comes her big cake. I'm preparing. We'll double Dynamax. That's okay. Wild Dynamax, you can Gigantamax. When Diamond and Pearl comes out, we should be getting Mega Evolutions back. That would be cool. I think I've mentioned this before, but I much prefer Mega Evolutions over the uh, Dynamaxing. Opal, this is payback for uh, for being a good teammate. <laughs> we have to show the world that they're not as great as we thought. She's still really awesome. Max, the old stuff. That should take your cake out of commission. I miss Mega Evolution. They have them on Pokemon Go and it's pretty cool, but I haven't been playing Pokemon Go as, uh, as much lately. I'm lucky if I get on once a week now. Oh, what's this? Somebody's at my door. Right. Ah, so it turns out it was just Amazon. Cool. We've defeated them right out of the gate. Now you need to keep winning. Well, we'll do our best. So we are... Yeah, I figured Marnie and Hop were going to win. Just because of Zacian. So... Whoa, what? Alistair and Milo beat Avery. Beatty, what did you do? Beatty had to have died in two seconds. That's the only excuse I am accepting. BD died, lickety split, and then they ganged up on Avery's beastliness. I cannot believe Avery lost. Well, to be fair, Alistair has some dark types. Hmm. Dude, I think that, I think Milo and Alistair cheated or something. I don't believe that for one second. Oh crap, I forgot. Oh, we're hop, hop and Marnie, hop and Marnie. Okay. So, let's do hop and Marnie. You know, let's lead off with Tim, dude. We haven't done anything with Tim Tim in forever. Let's do it. I feel like we have not used Tim Tim in the longest. Well, we've used them, but we haven't let off with them. Marnie and hop. What am I thinking? Against Zacian? I think we have to eliminate Marnie first and double team Zacian. That's what we're gonna do here. Which Pokemon do you think I should knock out first? We 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 double team Marnie. That is simple. Simple as that. Both of my rivals are here. Marnie and Pokemon Trainer Hop. Mortifico. Forget about that sheep. Actually, that thing hits hard. Mr. Rhyme. Remember our gym challenge? I'm gonna let loose all the frustration. Gold rivals are teaming up to take you down. Beat it! Alright, so. 
Let's brick break. We're going for the Morpico here. And this Tim Tim, this is my baby since the beginning of the game. No EV training except aside from what he's done battling people. No, uh, I haven't changed his nature. I haven't done anything to him. I just gave him a cool move. Mr. Rhyme, of course. You don't want to touch me with that, baby. Nasty plot. Is Mr. Rhyme going for the sweep? Oh my lord. Oh, Scrafty. We're gonna go. I'm gonna go for Scrafty. What are you gonna do, Mr. Rhyme? What are you gonna do? Because that, that sheep can't take you off on this next hit. Uh, what's gonna happen here? Marnie's gotta go. Oh my lord, Marnie survived. Double edge. Coming in hot. Mr. Rhyme, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Psychic. On who? Oh no! You summoned Zaki in too early! Oh! Melanie is crazy. This crafty might actually finish you. Oh yeah, you're gone. Okay. This is okay. What are we gonna do about this? I'm probably gonna have to U-turn out of it. What is this thing weak against? I have to earthquake it or something. Oh, poor Darmanitan. It's gonna get one-shotted. Oh, God. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I think I have to earthquake it. I think I do. Let me see what options do I have. If I do knock off, does that knock the sword out of Zacian's hand? And does that make it unevolve to, like, a regular form? I've never even thought about trying that. We're gonna try it. It's a stupid idea, but he's so fast. It's a stupid idea, but I'm willing to risk it for the biscuit. He, he's gone in one hit. Oh my god, the Zakian's about to sweep us, guys. Oh my god, oh my god. Alright. We're fine. I'm just trying this. Does it knock the sword off? It? It didn't knock the sword off, so Zakian stays. Okay, okay. You know... It makes sense because it's like Mega Evolution. If like they were Mega Evolved, I can't just knock the Mega Stone out of that hand and make them not, you know, un-Mega mid-battle. That that was so dumb. I don't know why I did that. So, Hop and Mel Melanie's gonna. Okay, she's definitely gonna. She's gonna go big. We're, I'm gonna go after the Scrafty. He's gonna be in the flavor to oblivion. Let's hope he targets me. Oh my god, he's gonna one-shot this Labyrinth. 500 health. Ooh, she might live. Close combat. Oh my god! Okay, okay. That's okay. That's alright. That's not the worst thing that could happen. Behemoth Bash, I think, would have finished us. Would have finished him. We're gonna get one hit from Lapras. Come on, Lapras. The Zakian's negative one. On defense and special defense. Max Geyser, this works. Let's see how much damage he does. And they're minus one, baby. Wow, that was quite good. Melanie is... She's gonna die, but she's gonna get her value today. Oh my god, Marnie. She's gonna mega... Well, what do you have again? Grim Snarl. You know what? This is okay. This is okay, this is okay. Get a load of this. Get a load of this. I'm gonna come back and earthquake everybody into the ground. Make my wishes come true in Gigantamax. Blade. Unnecessary. This is an unnecessary flex. I think Behemoth Blade would have one-shot Lapras. It's super effective, right? No? Okay, I think uh, Steel is super effective against Ice. Eh, whatever. Hey! 
that is not gonna. It, yeah, I, I figured it wasn't gonna defeat it. I just wanted to, just whatever, get a little bit of poke damage. You know, it's raining. It's actually raining in game. We have swift sw uh, swim. We would outspeed them no matter what, though. It doesn't need. It, it's not necessary. Let's just Yomi and Earthquake everybody down. I just thought about it, and I'm like, if this was a real match against another player, and I had the rain, I would definitely come in. Oh no, that star fall, that's a, that's a fairy move, that would destroy Marcelino. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, that would destroy, right? Or is that a psychic move, star fall? I think that's a fairy move. I don't know. Regardless, Earthquake coming in hot. Melanie, she actually did really well. To be fair, it's it's Zacian, bro. Like, what are you gonna do against Zacian? Let's let's be real here. I'm really proud of how well I've I've owned this move. Get ready to get sent packing. E Max, oh my lord, it hits hard. Am I asleep? Yomi might actually go down in this battle, guys. Inteleon. We're gonna go for another Earthquake here and just pray. We're just... What do we do? Do we Earthquake and get damage on both? We do. We do. And then Marcelino comes in with a Rain. Cleans up with Surf. Oh, look at that. Grim Snarl. Go ahead and Starfall me. Go ahead, do it. Look at that. Jerry level 100, baby. Max new. Goodbye, Yomi. I love you, Yoke. One HP! Are you serious? He held on so I wouldn't feel sad. It's because of our friendship. Oh, Grim Snarl, it's done. It's over for you, buddy. Even lost your Gigantamax. Come and get it. I cannot believe Yomi held on. That is the power of love, guys. Wow, Grim Snarl. Get poopy down. That was, that was a good fight. Zakian doing what it does. I don't understand how anybody in this tournament ever beats Zakian. I got. I, poor Hop. All right, we're up against Piers and Raihan. I, I mean, I would. I wouldn't. I'm not. Well, I wasn't surprised here. You know, I kind of figured they, if they lost to Milo and Alistair, I'd have thought this was like a hack of some sort. So uh, let's see. So what are, what are we gonna do here? I think this is fine. Yeah, we want to one shot. We want to one shot the um, the dragon dude. We want to take him out ASAP. And Peters is not going to be a problem. If we get rid of the dragon guy, it's over. Where was Leon? Was Leon not in this tournament? I'm actually surprised Peters made it to the end. Like, who are the question marks? They beat Rose and Oleana? Dude, this is such a tough fight for the enemy because we have Melanie that has ice. Well, they have... Okay... Okay, this dude has Dark Type. That that kind of fights her Mr. Rhyme a little bit because it's a psychic ice. Well, mm, this is actually a good fight for us, a good matchup for us. It's not bad. If I could handle Peters, but that would cover her, and then she could handle Raihan. But I'm going to handle Raihan because he's the only one that can Gigantamax here. Why allow him the chance to be strong? I'm not going to. Dark and Dragon, Scales and Shade, Fairy types get us both. Oh, that's right. If we had a fairy. Woo! Alright, Ice Beam for that uh, Flygon. Sucker Punch, that's for me. Oh, yeah. Actually, a really strong Sucker Punch. No sandstorm for you, Raihan. That's the only reason I got rid of you. That sandstorm is an, anno uh, an annoyance. 
It's an annoying. <laughs> it's an annoying thing to deal with. Freeze dry. What does that do exactly? Gudra. Okay, Gudra. We're both doing ice moves. We're good to go here. Now I need to Dynamax now. I'm not concerned if you're Dynamaxing. We're gonna go for the uh, Dragon Pulse here for the stab damage. I don't think it destroys Gudra. Gudra might live. I don't know. We're level 100 as well. So you gotta think about that. That looked like a crit. Not even. Gooey! Another freeze dry coming in hot. Spontane. Time to win this and become a true Valerian star you were born to be. Duraladon. Does he Dynamax this turn? Nope, he doesn't get to Dynamax this turn. Raihan, I'm very sorry, dude. You're a good guy. I'm sure somewhere out there someone cares about you. Your skunk tank. Oh wow, it actually hit Mr. Rhyme this time. Dragon pulsing it up. Marcelino. Hit him with the good stuff, Gramps. Now your team for the champion battle doesn't even get a, a Dynamax or a Gigantamax. It gets nothing. Now it's just, it's a two-on-one. And Melanie was able to solo your stun tank because it wasted two turns attacking me. So, not bad. Tim Tim 96. Everyone's looking good, man. By the time we're done with this tournament, everybody in our team should be 100. Maybe. Toxic Christy. Oh, that thing is squishy. Hit it with a psychic attack, Mr. Rhyme. It's slow, too. So we'll just drag and pose for the stab damage. I also have, uh... What should I use? I'm gonna use my steel move here. Just because I, like, rarely use it. Psychic. Oh, what, a, what if it shot here with psychic? And he's like, oh, hold on. Obstacle. Mr. Rhyme, I think you're going down. Oh, he's gonna Dynamax. Do we Dynamax with him? We do. We will. We Dynamax him, we're gonna lower his attack. Screw it. Oh no, he doesn't Dynamax! I've just. Jeez. Poor Peters, I'm sorry, dude. All right, yeah, eat this, Peters. Your Obstagoon, your big Obstagoon ain't gonna stop me. And I just remembered he, he's not, he doesn't even Dynamax. Oh, good Lord, this is abuse. This is definitely some form of abuse here. Well, Obstagoon, it was great seeing you. Thanks for playing this music. You know, for the ending credits for the main game and the for Crown Tundra. No! Oh! <laughs> God! I don't want to take selfies anymore. That was a good battle. Your team is just stronger for now. So let's see what who's uh who's cooking up next. See if we got a new character. If no, we're just taking Marnie because I think she was the next option. And I'm kind of worried about Marnie because that squishy Morpico. Oh boy. We'll figure it out, I guess. Let's see. Here's something. Semi grand. Yeah, the money is not very crazy. It's not like that first time you battle it and get a million smackaroos. What are you going to give me, buddy? 20 heavy balls. Come on. Oh! Wow, a hundred Pokeballs. Holy crap. Alright. Nice. Let's get back in there. So next, do we unlock someone new? No, these are all the same. Next up is Marnie. We unlocked Mustard, baby! But next up is Marnie. And then after Marnie... We get peers after peers. We start getting into all the crazy cool characters. Where is Leon? 
Leon? Okay, Leon, Rose, and Oliana. Oleta, Oliata, Oliana. The girl that likes Rose. Good lord. Alright, Marnie, let's go. Marnie's probably gonna be our last worst, the last worst person to team up with. So we're up against Melanie and Nessa. Okay. Leon and Hop? Oh my god. Okay, Leon and Hop. Oh my god, Mustard is gonna be carrying Alistair so hard. Avery and Beatty. Peony and Kabu, that's gonna be a good team. Leon and Hop. Ugh. What an annoying second battle that's gonna be. Thanks for choosing me. It's pleased to battle alongside you. Who am I up against? Uh, M Nessa and Melanie. Alright, let's, um... Lucian, let's let's start deleting people. Let's do this. Let's get a save in, too, because you've been here for a little bit. Let's do this. Alright, Marnie. Show me what you got. Don't fail me, Marnie. I was talking crap, but I'm hoping... You shut me up. Show me your skills. You had to defeat one of them. Melanie was actually not a bad ally. She she died to hop, but come on, he has a legendary. You gotta be real. Everyone else, she survived and did really well, I think. Melanie was a good ally. So it looks like uh, we're, we're heading into the area of good allies. So Melanie and Nessa. Ice and water. I'll hit him with a surf and you freeze it in midair. Stuff like that would be too much for a regular Pokemon game. If I if I do a surf attack and you freeze it with air, it could be like a a surf of ice. Like icebergs just crashing the enemy. Combination attacks like that. I think that could be the future of double battles, but I think we're far from stuff like that. It's gonna be very rap here. Oh, I should have. Nasty. Oh! Alright, we're off to a... Clearly off to a good start. Oh my god. Okay. We're clearly off to a good start here. That uh, Galissapod is going to run away because of emergency exit. Goodbye. That's fine. She just got a free swap. But Melanie's out for the count on that one. That's revenge. Toxapex. Okay. We're gonna... Scrafty. Oh, oh, this is not good for me. We're gonna... Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's my ally. Oh, my God. I'm like, Scrafty? That's not good. Oh, that's... That's problems for me. That is... Okay, let's do... I should have Nasty Plotted on that first turn. I'm gonna go for a Nasty Plot this time. Lucian is so good. I love the design so much. This is like one of my favorite legendaries. I like never use. That's for me, isn't it? It has to be. That'd be dumb not to be. That's not for me. And Scrafty ate that? Literally half Scrafty's health. Boom, a Thunder Punch. Very nice. Decent damage. Liquidation. Okay, Scrafty. Scrafty beat in two big attacks. Scrafty looking good. And we have a plus two special attack right now. Because of Nasty Plot. Now we're going to go for these Furry Wraps. And we knock out two of them. Critical hit on Tox Effect. Probably a necessary hit. Their Manitan is not very beefy. But if they go below 50, they turn into like their second form. And then that form gets kind of scary and beefy. But um, we're good. We're good here. We're in a good position. The final freeze is the deepest. Get ready to shiver down to your bones. Did she Gig uh, Gigantamax here? I'm not paying attention. Alright, that, that uh, Galissapod's gonna go down. Please tell me Nessa. Marnie and Nessa! Uh, uh, oh. So we're gonna eliminate... What? What? Scrafty? Oh my lord. First impression is strong, dude. All right, let's see what we do. If we can crit hacks, or not crit hacks, but stun that lap. <clears throat> that would be a big deal. Stun the Lapras, baby. I need it. Hydro Pump. Oh, I avoided the attack. It doesn't matter. <laughs> but she is going to Gigantamax this next turn. We weren't able to eliminate her. Melanie's going to Gigantamax. 
Even my last drop's enough to submerge you. Dreadnought. Dreadnought's going down. I'm not concerned. The big issue right now is that Lapras that's about to Gigantamax. I'm not going to Gigantamax my bird, because Fiery Wrath is too OP. Looks like an Ice Age is looming. I think I can still one-shot this Lapras. Even, uh, because of the HP it's at right now. There we go. It made no difference. They died together. Boom, Michael Bay blew up. It blew up the Dreadnought, too. I'll catch y'all, both of y'all, at the next competition. Sorry, ladies. Marnie, it's Marnie Scrafty's kind of beefy. I gotta say. One beefy Scrafty, it took two hits. The pair of us got washed clean away. You really did. You both got hit with that one banger. Not a bad team at all. Poor Melanie. It's like every time I just finish of course we're battling leon and hop what whoa who's surprised not me who's surprised <sighs> okay oh my god alistair dragged down mustard so bad avery and bd were, were allowed the double team mustard and then peony kabu i don't know who the question marks are but they always lose rose you guys get bodied every time <laughs> is that what happens um, so we're against Leon. Leon and... I'm gonna keep Lucian in. Is this dumb? Let me see. I think... I think I can keep Lucian in. We're gonna keep Lucian in. Let's do it. We're gonna open up with a nasty plot, though. I'm gonna prepare to sweep here. And if I can't sweep, I'm gonna prepare to die to Zacian. The good thing is, my Fiery Wrath hurts the Aegislash really well, and it hurts his next Pokemon, the, uh, the Dragon Ghost. Oh god, I can't think of the name right now. <clears throat> We're gonna have issues uh, with Charizard and Zacian. The sheep, I'm not too worried about. So hopefully we don't defeat the sheep too quickly. So, Marnie, team up with me. Let's get up. Let's get to town on Leon. Or you can hurt that sheep. Or most people really needs an evolution or something. It just stays like this forever, right? Leave them to me. Yeah, right. You've never been able to handle me. Alright, here we go. Nasty plot open, opening up. Look at that Aegislash. Level 80 and Hop's level 69. Leon, you gotta train your brother. That's the only change I would recommend at this tournament. Like, the more characters you unlock, everyone's level should go up one or two levels or something. So, like, by the time we get, like, the 10th character, everyone in the tournament's level would be 80 or higher, you know? Like, Leon and Mustard will both be 90. You know what I'm saying? Like, that would be sick, wouldn't it? So... Um, no, not me! Ooh. Oh my god! Oh, we're okay. We are right. We're fine. We're fine. And we got the Berserk stack, baby. We got the Berserk stack. Evil boy. That's the risky part. Now, if I can... What is Oh my lord, she bodied Asia Slash. Yo, all the crap I talked about more because she's working with me, guys. She's working with me, Balto. Let's go, Balto. That's right, I have another legend that we have, Balto. Let's see if we can get that flinch. We haven't flinched a single. Well, we don't need to flinch anybody. <laughs> Never mind. I was like, yeah, let's see if we get the flinch. Not, not needed because they're gone. Okay. Now. The issue is, do I outspeed anybody in here? Do I outspeed Zack? Do I outspeed Dragapult? That's what it's called. 
If I can hit the Dragapult with Fury Wrath, it's over, I think. Zacian, no way. I, I, that, I'm pretty sure that survives, but... The goal is, if I can go first, I can... We can flinch. Come on, baby. Torment. Okay, what do you... Okay, this is good. Just let me do it. Oh, no! That's that's from Morpico? Yeah! I'm sorry, little buddy. <laughs> oh, my God. Leon just sacrificed a special attack for that. Negative two stages. Oh, no! No! Oh, I cannot outspeed Zack. How fast is this thing? How Wait, how slow am I? Let's find out. This is okay. This is okay. Let me... How, how slow am I? Let me see something. My speed. 215. Wow. They're really fast. Okay. Uh, what are we going to do here? I can easily Yomi and Earthquake them to the ground. But then I'm going to have issues with Charizard as usual. I could also... Hmm. The issue is that... That Zacian. What do I do? What do I do? Um, let me see. So, what's Hop's last Pokemon? Inteleon. Okay. Let's do it. I am so sorry, Scrafty. I have to Earthquake you. I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. You know what? Do I go for a Meteor Mash first? I'm gonna go for a Meteor Mash on Zacian first to see if I can get that proc. That's what I'm gonna do. Let's see if we can get the attack proc. Oh my god, that one shot Zack! Oh my god, he's so squishy next to my, my Yomi. I didn't think that would happen. Well, I'm not complaining. No complaints here, I will take it. Well, this is even better for me. I didn't have to destroy Scrafty. Oh my god, this worked out. Hopper, are you gonna Gigantamax? It's so much better if you do, because then we don't have to fight that annoying Charizard. Let me see, who, who can Gigantamax? Me and uh, Leon. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. It's not very effective. That's all right. That's all right. We're gonna let... Oh. Oh, snap. Okay. That critical hit wasn't supposed to happen. I'm sorry, huh? The plan was to let Hop Gigantamax take him out on the next turn. But, uh... That's okay. Draco Meter, that shouldn't defeat anybody. If this kills somebody, it's such a... He's cheating. Look at that. There you go. Yeah, you're negative two in special attack. You're, you're like... Now you're negative four. You're essentially worthless. You're just a punching bag at this point. Get paralyzed, I hope. Oh, fine. Fine, fine. Don't get paralyzed. I don't, I don't, I don't need you to get paralyzed. I'm gonna go for Meteor Mash here. It's a monster, man. I have not gotten the attack up. Boost this battle. Things are not working out. I did not realize... That Meteor Mash can one-shot Zack. Now I, I just learned something. Holy crap. You're so strong, I've got to doff my cap. But it isn't over yet. But guess what, buddy? Oh no, wait, he can, Gigantamax! He can, right? Yup, he can. Here comes... Oh my god. Alright, fine. I will join you. We will Gigantamax together. I'm over here thinking this is the final battle of the championship. There's still someone else after. I can't believe they put like the hardest team. I guess Hop isn't the hardest to say. But I think that's how they should have did it. Every time you unlock the new character on your team, they should have made the enemies go up a level. I think that'd have been pretty cool. Cause then by the end, Cause what, what is there, 14 characters? By the end, Leon and Mustard would have been like level 94 by then. Which I think would have made this really worth the time, like the, the grind. 
Right now I'm just kind of grinding this to see what characters we get. That's about it. Oh, that Charizard is still alive, dude. Are you going to finish the job, Scrafty? Here comes his uh, fire move. Wildfire. Airstream. What? Okay. He, oh, he gets the speed boost. Oh, this is actually smart. Dude, if this was competitive, that speed boost would actually be clutch. He gets it. He defeats my, my ally. He gets the speed boost. Hits me with the wildfire. I would have to protect this turn or something. But ain't nobody got time for that because this is against CPU. He's actually doing it. He's actually doing it. Oh. oh, yeah, but I'm level 100, dude. If he was level 90-something, he might have defeated me there. When this tournament's done, I, I gotta see how many characters are unlockable. Just to see how many levels they could be. Because then you could allow Hop, not, not Hop, but uh, you could allow Leon and Mustard to get to 100. That would be sick. Like all the guys that naturally are at 80, you can allow them to get to like 100. Peony Kabu? I'm not surprised to be feral with you, Peony Kabu. What are we going to do about that? I'm trying to ride my bicycle. Why am I doing that? Okay. Um, Peony Kabu. Kabu, I'm very sorry. That's all I have to say. All right. Okay, we're on to the final battle. Marnie, we've got to win this. We've got to win this because we already defeated some of the toughest opponents here. Oh, Peony and Kabu be the ones to triumph. I am not con concerned. With my, with my Kingdra on the field, the only concern I have here is Peony. Even then, you know, my Yomi can outdo him completely. But poor Kabu, he doesn't have a chance here. What's gonna save him is maybe I won't do Surfs to defeat Marnie, but maybe I will Surf on him. I think I will Surf, just to, sh just to show him that I don't care. Marnie, you know what? Let me show you what it, how a champ battles. Drought. Okay, that's going to cut the damage of water by half. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm still going to do surf. Boom, Torkoal still goes down. Motopico survives. Perserker almost down. Perserker, I hope you're attacking me because then next turn I can take out another two. I can take out three Pokemon next turn. I'll take out Perserker, Motopico, and the next fire type. Whoa, Marty! With the body bag or a wheel, baby. Let's go. Marty, I'm sorry for the surf, but we just got two kills. For over, for what, 70% of your health? I'd consider that a worthy trade. Here comes Agron. He's gonna have his, um, 1 HP. He's got sturdy. And here comes Arcanine. I definitely have to handle the Arcanine, without a doubt. So we're coming in hot. Intimidate, that's not a big deal for me. I feel bad for, uh, more people here because they're gonna die for no reason. But, um, it's okay. We're eliminating a very tough Pokemon in the process. Arcanine is always going to be an issue. Oh my god, it lived! Arcanine survived! Oh crap, he must have EV trained that in special defense. NHP, here comes a Flare Blitz coming in hot. But I resist that, that thing only does 25% damage to me because of my typing. So, Dragon Resist, that makes it half, and I'm Water, that makes it half again, so it only does 25% damage. That's why Kingdra is, like, the best choice against a Fire Trainer. Here comes a Scrap thing. I am about to... I'm sorry, Marnie. 
Right now, Marnie's only deaths are because of me. She's actually a good ally, despite all the crap I was talking earlier. <clears throat> Marnie's pretty good. She'll probably survive this, too. Oh, she will. Look at that. Boom, shakalaka. What do we have? Sent Scorch and uh, the Elephander. Elephander coming in hot. Somebody's gonna Gigantamax. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. Senna Scorch. Let's see, if you let me Gigantamax, I'm gonna do it too. Who's doing it? Because you know one of them is doing it. Who's doing it? Who's doing it? Copper Roger. Who is gonna Dynamax? Marnie and Kabu. Lucky. Lucky. Scrafty will survive this. That Senna Scorch is gonna hit, get hit hard still. I think for every enemy on the field, they divide the damage up. So since there's three, it's divided up by three. My sir. That's why. That explains why Arcanine survived. Purple should have lived this. I'll take the defeat, that's fine. Oh well, yeah, this Senta Scorch by by the last character, they'd have been like level 90 almost. Nice overgrowth. Oh, someone's going down. Crap, he might live. Oh no, sorry man, I heard him a little too much. That Senta Scorch actually ate my move really well despite me having a... Uh, Super advantage, the super advantage. The uh, super effective. Oh no! Woo! Woo -hoo. Play rough is tough. Alright, so they're healing a little bit. Do I. Do I Gigantamax and waste their time? Grim Snow. I'm gonna Gigantamax because I don't want to kill her last Pokemon that quickly. That Grim Snow is so beefy. 235 HP. Good. I'm gonna go for Max Geyser on a Sinuscorch. And that's just to get the sunlight out of here because I think the sun out here is really still hurting my Surf attack. That's actually, that's why Arcanine survived the sun. But dang drought, man. I didn't even think about it. We're still gonna get one shot by, um,. Bulk up. Oh yeah, they have that move, the... I gotcha. Okay, that's her passive. That lets them go first. Was it Trickster? Bulk up is good. That going to stall beef up. Senna Scorch is gone, and now it's gonna rain. And if you don't play rough me to eliminate me, you're gonna feel it, buddy. <clears throat> Later, Kevin. we have here heavy slam that was i don't think that was a oh 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 my god oh. <laughs> i'm over here like yo i don't think that was the right play man he just one shot at marnie Kaparaja. dude i'd be sweating right now if this was just a 1v1 like marcelino was my last pokemon If this tournament was you have three and your ally has three, I would take this a ton more seriously. But the fact that I have six and then I have an ally with three, like they have nine Pokemon versus six, it's kind of OP, you know? <clears throat> Maybe something they, they could look into fixing in the future or uh, making it a little different. Oh, God. And it's raining. 23,000 for that? Good Lord. Congratulations. So I just got a hundred Pokeballs as a result from the uh, ball guy. Maybe he'll give me a hundred great balls now. It's a lot of money I just saved. A hundred Pokeballs? That's great. <clears throat> Let's see what we get here. We did it. We beat every single one of them. And here, one more thing. There's more people that want to party with you. 
And ball guy. Ball guy, what you got, baby? Take this. A hundred great ball. Two, two nuggets. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. He gave me two nuggets the other day. Let's take a look at who's who's available. Let me see. So let's say every battle, they went up a level. Who did we just... Oh, we just got Leon! Sick. So let's say every battle, everyone went up a level. They're all level 70s. So 75, 80, 85. So hop, everybody that's starting at level 70 could get up to level 87 easily on their first Pokemon. Which means on their last Pokemon, they would be level 90. Which means... Trainers like Leon and Mustard would be a hundred. I think this Peony would be a hundred too. I'm not sure. But a uh, nice dude, man. Next episode is gonna be insane. After Piers, because he doesn't Gigantamax, we're gonna start getting into the super strong people. I really can't wait to get into like Leon, Avery, especially Mustard. I feel like we're gonna truck everybody once I get Leon and Mustard, just because they're level 80s. But, um, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Thanks for watching. Hope that I catch you next time. And until then, see ya.